Quartiles of a data set. What are quartiles? Well, quartiles split data into four equal sections. And how do we do that? Well, one, we order the numbers and find the median, and then find the median of each of the halves. And they give us the three quartiles. Let's start on this first one. So let's find the median. So we've got 2 and 11, 4 and 9, 5 and 8, and we've got two numbers left, so it's in the middle. So the median, or Q2, is 7. Now we find the median of each half. So we've got 2, 4, 5, 6 is the first one. So let's pair them off. So that means it's going to be halfway between here. So Q1, the lower quartile, is 4.5. Let's do the same for the other one. We've got 8 and 11, so it's halfway between here. So Q3 is going to be 8.5. Okay, let's go on to the next example. So again, let's pair them off until we're left with 1 or 2 in the middle. So this one we're left with 1 in the middle. So our median, or Q2, um, is 9. Now let's find the median of each half. And as it says uh, at the top, ignore median if odd number. So I'm going to squad that out. So the bottom half is 3, 5, 6, 7. So 3 and 7. So it's going to be halfway between those two numbers. So Q1, the lower quartile, is 5.5. And the upper quartile is going to be 11. Let's keep going with these two examples. So we've got 4, 16, 6, 13, 7 and 13, 8 and 11. We've got two numbers, so Q2 is 10. Let's work out the median of each half. So we've got 4 and 10, 6 and 8, so it's 7. So Q1, the lower quartile is 7, 10, 16, 11, 13. So it's 13 up here, so Q3, the upper quartile is 13. Let's keep going. 1 and 14, 3 and 12, 4 and 10, 5 and 10, 7 and 8. So our Q2, our median is 7. Now we ignore the um, median if there's an odd number. So the median of the bottom half is going to be 1 and 7, 3 and 4 is 4. So Q1 is 4. And 8 and 14, 10 and 12. So it's 10. Q3 is 10. 